smelly house, but Say. at least you don't have a bear. Bear on the run. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. He was just out for a jog. It was a nice afternoon for that. Getting some exercise. Yeah, some seriously. Water, I'm sure. Kind of warm to do that yesterday. Yeah, pretty but. good form on a sprint there, I thought. <laughs> not bad at all. Yeah, it did. It was actually pretty warm yesterday afternoon. Not as hot as it was on Sunday. We dropped off about 8 degrees, but still hit 83 degrees out at SeaTac. A lot of places in the low to mid 80s yesterday afternoon. We're going to continue that cooling today, though. Far from being cool, it's still going to be a warm afternoon. A normal high right now, sitting right there at 77 degrees. Checking the view as we look out, uh, we've got uh, partly cloudy skies just about everywhere I've checked this morning. You can see looking out across uh, Elliott Bay towards downtown Seattle, seeing clouds out there, and we're going to see quite a bit of sunshine sneak through those clouds during the course of the day. Out of the airport, uh, pretty good backup on the departure deck starting to form, but it's still a little bit early, and it's been a little bit quieter in the last week or two than it was uh, earlier in the summer. Cavalier Mid High School there in Lake Stevens, it uh, looks like more uh, clearing than clouds right now, so you should have a pretty nice sunrise there. Temperatures this morning mild once again. We're mostly in the mid 50s to right around 60 degrees as you head out the door for work this morning. Checking the University of Washington model showing clouds around this morning and then we should clear out. They probably see more sunshine as we head on towards midday and the afternoon. But then as we head towards uh, late afternoon evening, start to develop a few showers in the Olympics and we will see a few showers moving in. You see late tonight it will be after sunset tonight. They'll be primarily up to the north of Seattle, but you'll have those showers kind of around. You can see See a few sprinkles of very light showers worked the way down south during the course of the overnight hours. However, by the time we hit tomorrow morning, those are going to be pretty much moving on to the east. Might be a couple of sprinkles left over for the morning commute tomorrow, but overall it should be a dry commute on Wednesday. Then we clear right back out to sunshine. Should start to warm back up again tomorrow, and then we have a mostly sunny day as we head towards Thursday into Friday. Might see a chance of a shower late Friday night uh, and maybe early on Saturday morning, but otherwise a sunny pattern develops all the way into next week. So for today, we're going to be looking for partly sunny skies during the day. Look for temperatures getting into the mid 70s, and we'll see a chance of a shower moving in after sunset tonight. Morning sprinkled in sunshine, mid to upper 70s tomorrow into the low 80s again on Thursday. Friday, we'll see the clouds kind of roll in and that chance of showers again after dark. We're doing our, our showers at night time. It's pretty good timing. Upper 70s to near 80 degrees. Morning shower, then clearing on Saturday, and then sunshine for Sunday and Monday with high temperatures in the upper 70s and low 80s.